Okay, today's video, we're gonna show you how to drain your septic tanks with a regular garden hose. We did this because our septic tanks were filling with rainwater every time we had a heavy rainfall. So we had to drain it. Just for the record, there was no gray matter in the tanks, just rainwater and a little bit of mud. So you connect your garden hose, turn it on. Once it's full of water, you cap one end and then you take it down lower than where your tank is. This is an important step. You need to place the end into the septic tank. Once it's submerged, you can uncap the other end and allow for the flow of water through the hose. You'll see clear at first, and then you'll see a little bit of gray or darker water. You know you're in once it have continuous flow. Here, we had to cover our tank because we were expecting more water that same day. It took about six hours to drain, and we did the same thing for both tanks. It worked really well, and once again, just for the record, there was no gray matter in our tanks. Pure mud, soil, and rainwater. Here you just see us doing it to the second tank. Took about six hours for each tank. So a couple key points in summary is the garden hose has to be completely full with water before you cap it on one end and you has to be lower than the tank before you release it so you get good siphon. Once again there was no gray matter. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.